With Underworld Overlord, we already have the second tower defense game on Daydream VR, and it is a great one. You assume the role of the evil underworld overlord that has to defend the underworld from brave heroes that dare to penetrate deep into your territory. You command your evil army of skeletons, killer spiders, lava beds and more devilish creatures and deploy deadly traps to stop them once and forever. As you can tell, the game doesn't take itself too seriously and that makes it great fun. If you like tower defense games, you will feel right at home. At the beginning of each level, you deploy your army and the traps at dedicated places around the battlefield. In each level you can put 4 monsters of your choice and a number of traps that is only limited by your amount of gold. In the beginning you can only choose skeletons, but as you progress you unlock more monsters like a lava bed, a lizard that can shoot arrows, a spider and more. Same goes for the traps, where you first begin with spikes that shoot out of the ground, but quickly upgrade to poisonous gas treasure chests that lure your heroes where you want them to go, automatic crossbows and so on. The developers have been quite creative and it's fun to deploy monsters and traps that will unfold their evil intentions once you allow the heroes to enter the arena. Your goal is to defend the mysterious Animus, a sacred site that holds your evil powers. The heroes try to destroy this Animus and with it your power. On their way to the sacred site your monsters will try everything in their power to kill the heroes and they do that by themselves. You can still command them to go to any place you want simply by clicking on them with your pointer and guiding them to the desired location again by a click on the touchpad. You can also directly intervene by shooting fireballs, reanimating fallen soldiers or by resurrecting fallen heroes and putting a spell on them to have them fight for the dark side now. All gameplay mechanics work extraordinarily well and the battlefields are often so big that you need to change your point of view by selecting one of the huge eyeballs that hover over the playing fields. The heroes also come in a variety of different characters. There are muscular knights, mysterious mages, skilled archers and more that try to bring you down. Good that most of them are nothing more than greedy treasure hunters that can be lured into certain doom with a well-placed decoy treasure box. Yes, Underworld Overlord is just as fun as it sounds. There is only one big problem that I need to point out here in this review. The AI sucks. The heroes are incredibly stupid. It is so funny at times that you wonder if this is actually a feature rather than a bug and programmed into the game in order to amuse you. Sometimes the heroes would simply stand around and get hit time after time by your automatic crossbow without moving away. Or they would rest within a poisonous gas trap until all their energy is gone. Or they would stand around and wait instead of attacking the animus until you have resurrected your whole army again. Something is seriously wrong with those guys. Or they just smoked a lot of pot before entering the underworld and who would blame them for that? Underworld Overlord looks fantastic, yes! There is a level of detail to this world that will make you enjoy this game time and again. The underworld and its inhabitants are designed in a playful comic art style that stresses the humorous concept of Underworld Overlord. Your skeletons and killer spiders don't look as if they came right out of hell, but more like right out of the cartoon network and that is great. Same goes for the heroes. The traps and environments are also top notch and make this underworld a place that is worth to defend against those wannabe heroes. Underworld Overlord works great in VR. You would not think that tower defense games need to be in VR to enjoy them, and that certainly is not the case since this could be a great 2D game as well, but if you hover over your world as you do in Underworld Overlord and command your creatures from a godlike position from within this world, you will want to see more tower defense games make the leap into VR. Also comfort wise there are no problems to be had in Underworld Overlord. The camera doesn't move at all so you won't feel sick when playing the game for any period of time. Underworld Overlord is a true surprise hit. I didn't see the title coming. It is great fun because it doesn't take itself too seriously and the gameplay mechanics work just like they are supposed to. Add beautiful environments and likable protagonists into the mix and you have a game that is hard to resist. If the developer could now still iron out those AI problems, we would have a must-play game for every tower defense fan. 
But even like it is, you can pick this one up and finally be the master of darkness that you always wanted to be. For the full written review of Underworld Overlord, go to daydreamdistrict.com. I hope you enjoyed this review, if you did, give it a thumbs up and of course subscribe to Daydream District to never miss any daydream content in the future.